Let's talk receiver swaps and new brake cars. <clears throat> we already know that they have very common parts <clears throat> to utilize using the same parts to go over very different grades like these wheels can be put on these spindles but these tires and wheels do not come off they're put on with uh, press fit rods now these do but this front end will swap into several trucks you have this receiver okay now this receiver here who knows the built-in two cell 6.4 receiver box you see how it's straight here no grooves no notches see how this one has grooves and notches grooves and notches the 7.5 board this is the two cell RC charger board this is a 6 volt board alright this 6 volt board can't remember what it came out of I got too many cars now. but <clears throat> Say you want this truck to handle more juice. Well, you take this receiver. And it goes in here. Eventually. And it locks into place. Well, it's got nowhere to screw it. Alright. So make a hole and screw it down in the factory location. Seems to be this six volt notched receiver mount is the same as the Track Attack 18.4. Not that, not the Track Attack, as the the one that the Wolf Pro has in it, <clears throat> the 12, the 12.8. So you can take your 12.8 board that came in your Wolf Pro and put it in your 7.5 RC car and just plug it up all right say like this RC charger here you need for that a straight board well here we have a a 6 volt straight board same as the Baja the Baja the straight board too the Baja this is not this is a 12 8 board mount but this is out of a uh, track attack with the treads now this 12 8 it's different from the wolf pro with the 12 8 the wolf pro is notched this one is flat and when I say flat I mean there's no notches on the side it just drops straight in I'll show you that right here see this is a 6 volt board and this is actually a 6 4 this is the original board out of the the Baja there so what you're gonna do Unplug your motors, drop that in, screw it in. Now you've got a cell pack car. I uh, don't have any 9.6s. I'm sure they're similar. So, you know, instead of swapping and modifying batteries, you could just swap the whole receiver board out of your 9.6 into your lithium charger car. Say it died. Um, <clears throat> same goes. If you want, if you have one, and your battery pack's dead, you want to go to Walmart, get one of these two cell RC charger setups. Um, you can do that. You can see it won't fit in the ones with the notches. It's got to be straight on the side, like these two. So I could take this, put it directly in this Baja, and then it's got an internal battery. Um, here's another example. The, the 7.5 this car here was a 7.5 ain't gonna fit in this car because I haven't tried that yet all right but you, you, you get what I'm saying and here we go here's a 12.8 Wolf Pro circuit board this is a 7.5 truck all right so get it finagled down in there right you say oh well I've got this tab in the way all right cut the tab drop it in drill a new hole here match the body 12.8 then <clears throat> this is the wolf rear end and the Baja the wolf rear end has a 180 motor not a 130 
say you open this case up, you modify this, you put a 180 motor in it, you got a 12.8, look at that, ah, 12.8 volt, little truck, and, you know, it's, it's that simple, these things are like Hondas, parts interchange, so, you got two different types, you got the notches here and here that drop in and slot up and then screw in and you've got the straights that pretty much just interchange with each other so like it's it's that simple see um, even the Baja if I wanted to I could take this circuit board back out take this lithium RC charger put it all back together Pop it in there, recharge on the go, USB port. Now, granted, this only has a two cell in it. Two, 3.2 cells that charge up to 3.7 at max. If it hasn't been ran down and ran down and ran down. But that's, 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 this is, you know, it's, uh, it's pretty much plug and play type stuff. You know, there's a little little couple of things you have to think about and figure out you know, here's a six volt it's got notches this will probably drop into that better than the I've already had them in there it takes it takes a little finesse see and then you slide it up it's locked in screw it in that takes this from a, a five double a car to one that you can Put a pack in and you say why would i want to do that well because these are expensive and seven five volts so it, i'm sure the nine sixes are the same way you can even get this 12 8 in there and you see i can't do it one-handed it's like trying but you know it's got a tab so just cut the tab you got a 12 8 on a small body upgrade that 130 though because that the the 12 volts, I kill it quick. That's it. Just a little drop and go. I mean, hey, look at this. See, we got this old charger body. Got this Wolf Pro receiver board. I go right in there. It's a big car. Car this size needs a 130 motor with a 12.8 board.